informative speech on um, Chef Grant Atkins, who is um, one of one of the best chef, chefs in the country. Um, he was awarded the James Beard Award for Best Chef in America. He's won uh, Gourmet Magazine's Best Restaurant in America after being open for 13 months, which is completely unheard of. All the while, uh, after being diagnosed with squamous cell carcinoma of the tongue, um, <clears throat> being in as much pain as he was from this really, really difficult um, type of cancer, he still ran his restaurant, was still there, first one in, the first, last one to leave, um, and is really just shows a lot of his character and that he was able to do that and has beaten that cancer now. A um, little bit about him, you know, he, he worked in some of the best restaurants in the world, uh, worked at the French Laundry with Thomas Keller, worked at El Bouli with um, Baron Adria. Um, that's kind of where he totally turned his, his whole view of the restaurant industry and the restaurant itself into something that's more entertainment and um, brought that into his restaurant Elena and then now later he's breaking it into this new restaurant called Next which instead of being like a normal restaurant where you make a reservation you actually buy tickets for this um, the menu changes every three months um, it doesn't change in the way that it's seasonal or anything like that. It's it's more a time period, um, you know, f anywhere from France in 1942 to you know whatever, um, and just goes to show you that he just is totally taking this restaurant industry to a whole another level. Um, at Elena, his first restaurant, which he still owns and operates, um, everything was everything was brought about in that same mind frame of changing it, the whole experience. There's you know no tablecloths on the tables. There's no silverware on the tables. Um, the the dinnerware is is designed by one man who. Almost takes uh, it, it's almost it's almost architecture in a way. Um, you know, there'll be things where he will have things hanging from the from the plates, almost like trapeze and various things like that. Um, but uh, a quote that he had that I'd seen in his book, Life in the Line, is um, it says, "If I gave you a, a root beer float." And you looked at it, and it's not a liquid, but it's a solid. And it's not. It's clear. It's not brown. It, you know, it, it, any preconceived notion that you had about that root beer float has now been transformed into this. But it actually tastes exactly like a root beer float. That's kind of his. That kind of sums up his entire mindset with the whole restaurant and the, you know, cooking and basically everything that has to do with restaurant business. So just wanted to do my informative speech on uh, this great chef, uh, Grant Atkins.